So ask people, do you feel I'm angry? Ask somebody else, do you feel anger from me? You know, let yourself ask that question of others. Often, you know, often we don't want to know what other people feel about us, and that's why we project emotions at them, because we don't want to know what they've got to say. But often, they can tell us a lot of things. So I've had to ask people, do you feel I'm angry at this point, or do you feel I'm sad, or what are you feeling? And when Mary says, you're angry, and I know I'm angry, I say, yeah, I'm angry, all right. They're coming, they're coming. <laughs> <laughs> that, you, right? it, but can you see how important it is to work through issues emotionally together? Because if, if Mary and I split up just because of one thing, one thing that came up, what would happen is all the other things that could have come up after that we now are not dealing with. Now, I'm not suggesting to stay in an abusive situation. So, for example, if, if Mary, if I get angry at Mary, right, and I project anger at her, and she then addresses that anger with me, and I don't want to own that emotion, and I just get angry back at Mary, and then she tries to address it with me, and then I get angry back at Mary again, now the situation's abusive. You don't need to stay in abusive situations. And if you are staying in a situation like that, you've got very big emotional injuries that are causing you to stay there because you're not loving you. Does that make sense? So allow yourself to feel that. But, but stay, if, 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 like if I get angry with Mary, and Mary says, you're angry with me, and please you know, go into the emotion and deal with the emotion, and I start getting into the emotion, now she has a good reason to stick in the relationship because I'm actually now dealing with the emotion and if I deal with the emotion and get to the court, I'm not going to be angry with her about that issue ever again. So that's going to be very, very helpful for our relationship. But So obviously when none of us are perfect yet, right? We can't expect each other to never be angry. Right? But if someone's getting angry about the same issue over and over again, then that's abusive. And it's time to do something about it. We need to do something about it in those situations. Does that make sense for everyone?